Hi guys, welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking. Welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking, and today what I'm going to show you is my Philly steak and cheese pizza. It's really good, so let's get started. I have my oven on 450. Saute a half an onion chopped and a half green pepper chopped. I have a little olive oil in the pan. Now that the onion and green pepper are sauteed, I'll place them in a bowl. I'll place a pan back on the stove. The steak that I used is, it's sandwich slices, so I use like three slices. And it's almost like the steak and cheese, um, the steakums. But this one I buy at a wholesale market. This steak I find to be a lot better. We used to use this at our restaurant. I have three slices of steak that are thinly sliced. Place the steak in. While the steak is cooking. And one ready-made pizza crust that I'll roll out. I'll drain all the excess grease off. I have my homemade Alfredo sauce. I'll place the Alfredo sauce on top of the dough. Now I have my steak, my green peppers, and my onions. I'll place it on top of the sauce. Just spread it around. And that was perfect. And I left a little edge here for the crust. Now I picked up this cheese. It's mozzarella and provolone together. It's shredded and it's two cups. So I'll open up the package. I'll sprinkle it on top. I have my oven preheated at 450. 
and I'll place this in my 450 degree oven until the uh, crust is a nice golden brown. So into the oven it goes. So now I'll place the pizza in my 450 degree oven. I have it on the center rack. I'll check on the pizza, see how it's doing. Looking good. Now it's time to take the pizza out of the oven. Now doesn't that look good? So now I'll slice it up. Look at how good that looks. That came out perfect. Yum.